everyone, it's Sharon from the City of Burlington. I work for the Child, Youth and Family Team as a Recreation Programmer and I'm bringing you a quick and easy activity that can be super fun that you can do with your kids. Hopefully you would have most of this stuff on hand and you can um, do a few different things if you don't have some of the tools that you need. This is marble painting. Um, can make some really, really interesting masterpieces and you can take some time to let little imagination soar. So this is a box that I picked up at the grocery store when I was there. Um, if you have an empty uh, 24 can box from Pop, you can use that. You grab something like this at the store. You could also do it in a cookie sheet. I would just line it so that it makes it easier for you to clean up. Painter's tape, if you have some, only because then when you are removing the tape from your masterpiece, ideally it will rip less. This is just regular white printer paper. I also have cardstock. It works equally well with that or with um, construction paper if that's what you have on hand. <clears throat> I have an assortment of paints. These happen to be outdoor patio paints, doesn't matter. You can use temper paint, acrylic paint, anything again that you happen to have on hand will work for this activity. In this uh, yogurt container, I also have marbles. Um, if you don't have marbles, you could use uh, ping pong balls. If you have really round rocks, um, bouncy balls, anything of that nature will also work. Marbles are great though. This empty container has a, just a titch of water in it just so that I can throw my marbles in when I'm done. And honestly, to wash them up, I just pop my hand over the top and shake and it, pretend, like, it pretty much cleans off the marbles. There usually isn't anything left as long as you do it sort of right away. So I'm going to take my white piece of paper, pop it in my box and use some of the painter's tape couple pieces will do. You don't need a whole lot just to hold it down for when you're rolling. Try not to cover it too much. That one's a little bit thicker. This one's a little bit narrower, but pretty basic. Pick whatever colors you happen to want to use. Obviously, if you have a colored paper, pick something that's going to work. Uh, you can, again, you can do this in a couple of different ways. This one, I'm just going to do blobs. So here's a couple of blobs. Oh, that's a big blob. You can do them in piles. You can do them all over. You can do them as a line. Doesn't honestly matter. They're all going to turn out interesting. All right. So there it is. Pretty simple. Blop, blop, blop and you're ready to go. If you don't have ones that have drippy caps, you can just take a paintbrush and just kind of blob on little blobs. Um, what I would like to do is hold your bucket so that it is a little bit sideways so that the marbles aren't right in it. And then all you're doing, oh, that one got stuck, is rolling your marbles around. And your kids can do this and it's super fun and you can swirl it. You can go back and forth, side to side. And when your kids are happy with the result, all I'm gonna do is take those marbles pop them in the water and set them aside and there is your masterpiece. You can leave it to dry in the box like so or you can just pop it out. Easy peasy lemon squeezy and set it aside somewhere to dry. I have a couple of examples that were done previously. You can see this one was done with just some lines and trying to keep the flow in one area so that you end up with some lines. This is another blob variety. Um, this again is drawing lines across. Uh, this is cardstock. So cardstock is nice just because it won't curl on you when you are um, after it's drying. And this one again is just lines and just rocking back and forth and taking your time. Experiment, see what you can come up with. Um, 
post it on our website at burlington.ca and share this with us because we think they're pretty awesome. Again, another way for you to stay safe and do a fun activity while we are in this current situation. Don't forget to live and play every day. Thank you. <laughs>